in this English lesson. I wanted to help you learn the English phrase, same old, same old. No, this is not a typo. We do sometimes say this. We say this when something was the same as the last time we did it. Today, I had my first day of work, actually my second day. I'll explain that more later. Uh, and if you were to say to me, Bob, how was your day at work? I would say, you know, same old, same old. Um, we did the same things as we did last year at this time. Same old, same old. I was in meetings. I had to wear my mask all day. It was basically the same old, same old. You can use this for any situation. Maybe you're watching a TV show and someone says, oh, did you see the last episode? And you could say, yeah, it wasn't that great. It was just the same old, same old. It was the, the same story and it was kind of boring. The second phrase I want to teach you today I'm kind of embarrassed by this phrase because it's quite simple when I look at it. The phrase is, I'll have the same. Um, I think you probably all know this phrase. It means that you'll have the same thing that someone else is getting, usually in a restaurant. Um, I was actually in a restaurant recently with my brother and he ordered a hamburger with fries and I said, I'll have the same. And I thought I should teach you this phrase. But now when I look at it, I think this, this is actually a pretty easy one, isn't it? Well. Maybe it's your lucky day. Instead of two hard to understand phrases, you got one somewhat easy to understand and one really easy to understand phrase. So if you say, I'll have the same, it means you'll get the same thing as someone else in a restaurant. So to review, the phrase same old, same old means that something is the same. And work definitely was the same old, same old today. Same people, same classrooms. Like I said, same masks, same... Uh, little lines on my face at the end of the day from the strings on the mask when they go around my ear. So it was definitely the same old, same old. And if you say in a restaurant, all have the same, after someone you are with orders their food, it means you want the same order as them. It's an easy way to order stuff in a restaurant. But hey, let's look at a comment from a previous video. This comment is from, drum roll please, so sometimes we say that in English to be funny, like we're waiting for a drum roll. It's from Alex. Alex says, I got confused when you said around age 65, she decided to retire. Without subtitles on, I heard around 865, she decided to retire. And my response is, maybe you heard correctly. And my mom is over a thousand years old. Just kidding. Actually, when I went back and listened, it did sound like that a bit. I was speaking quite quickly. So thanks, Alex, for that comment. Yes, in my previous video, I was talking about my mom and she retired at age 65. And if you listen to it a certain way, you might have heard it as me saying that she retired in the year 865, sometime, I guess, in the Middle Ages. So anyways, I'm a little bit tired. I'll tell you what I've been up to the last couple of days. I drove that van on Wednesday of this week. I drove that van almost four hours to bring my son to university. Um, it was a long drive, but it was a fun drive. We got to talk a lot about things that we've done in the past and him growing up. Uh, and then I had to drive it all the way back again yesterday, four hours by myself. So I listened to a lot of rock and roll music. That kept me going. I left actually at five or six in the morning. I think it was quarter to six. Um, and it took me about four hours to get back. Um, but yeah, that's what I've been up to. One more kid is off to university. Um, the family keeps growing and they get older and then eventually they go somewhere else. That's how life works, isn't it? Anyways, Bob the Canadian, thanks for watching this little short lesson. I'll see you in a couple days with another one. Bye.